Yo, what is up guys? So for today we're going to be talking about Destiny 2. Now specifically we're going to be talking about something that I would love to see Destiny 2 bring into the game. And I'm going to be doing these sort of videos because honestly the Destiny 2 is dry right now. I haven't done the mission for the person that died. Mostly because I don't know where, I don't know what's happening but it's not activating. So until I can do it, uh, that video won't be up. I do want to post that video though. But I wanted to make this video because A, there's nothing for me to do right now. If you guys heard that, it's my moving my keyboard. But there's just nothing to do in Destiny 2 right now. Aside from the weeklies for the Bright Dust, which is something I've been doing a lot for, for the armor for Halloween and whatnot. There's really not much. Like, I can do some of the backlog that I do have, but I don't want to do that because it's boring. It's mostly just trying to get titles and gear pretty essentially like I do I want to know I I want to get like titles and whatnot but the thing that I really want to talk about today is loadouts so if you don't know Destiny 2 really doesn't have a way to for you to save your loadout and up until this point I've probably had some gameplay in the background uh if you guys look at the, at the video right now this is my hunter right here uh this is my pvp sweat mode as you guys can see, I have 90 mobility. Uh, the traction actually gives you a, a hidden 10. So 90 mobility plus 60 resilience to really fight off dumb things like one shot rift sniper shots or thorn, stuff like that. That's why I like to uh, stay at 50 plus 96 recovery, which is dope as hell. Uh, I would go for 10, but ultimately it really doesn't matter too much to me. Uh, don't care about discipline 76 on intellect if i could get four more on intellect it'd be 80 which would be like a solid four minutes i would love that hopefully i can get that and strength doesn't matter to me either so essentially this is like my pvp loadout i usually run this or not that one which are this one right no no wrong helmet it's this one this is the other set which is essentially almost the same thing as my last one which is awesome Again, 80 mobility, 60 resilience, 90 recovery, and then like 65 intellect. That's the one that I really miss out on. But essentially, I have everything almost at the same spot, which is dope as hell. And as you guys can see, you guys, you, you, like, if you guys have seen my videos and known me for a while, you guys usually know that I have a rule with my with my characters that I can't more than I can't wear more than one piece if you guys can see right now I'm wearing more than one piece of list this is because this is essentially how I save my loadouts so I would really love it if I don't know like Bungie let us like there's a button like right like let's say I go up to the simulator mask let's say like right here there's another button that says uh save or, or something like that it'd be awesome if i could press it and then save loadout or if there was like a button up here or like i don't know like where would the button be maybe next to the the here or it would be somewhere click the button and whatever armor pieces you have that's your loadout if you want to get us take it a step further it could be weapons as well that would be cool but ultimately i would love if i could be like this right here is my Trials of Osiris loadout. This is the loadout I would use all the time. If I want to be extra, extra, I could be like, I definitely want to do like Middle Tree, Void, with Eye of the Soul, Ancient Gospel, and Black Talon. This would be like my PvP role. Actually, let's change that to this one. So yeah, this would be my PvP role for Trials of Osiris, right? It would be cool if it saved all of this like okay so you use black talon nine hunger eye of soul plus middle tree a night stalker and then all of this so next time i click uh let's call it uh trials trials uh, sweaty trials run or sweaty trials loadout once i click it all of this it literally just snaps into place that way i don't have to think about it or do what i do here which i have different armor sets that are different loadouts like Let's say I'm playing PvE, right? This would be my PvE loadout most of the time. And again, like I said, it all depends on what like what armor set I'm using. So if I'm using this set, that means you know that I'm playing PvE and I'm doing like an extra sweaty play because this is taking armaments plus perpetuation, 
with traction, sniper, with sniper, scavenger, and taken barrier. Plus, uh, you should have it should be sniper launch or sniper reserves with enhanced sniper reloader and then increase like all of this. Th these are my 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 stats. They could be a bit better, but for what I do, I do love it. So I would love it if I could put like a solo flawless loadout because this is what I this is the loadout I use for my solo flawless run. I would love it if we had that option because at the at this point it this this is literally me having to like macgyver my way to make a loadout and it's kind of annoying to be quite honest because like right here i would love it if i could do that because then this would be my this would be my what is it called my taken my taken armaments loadout and then i could have like this one with hive armaments plus cal of, of uh, righteousness this one has hive armaments as well and stuff like that the only thing i would have to switch out is powerful friends but at this point uh, actually yeah i probably just would have hive armaments and maybe switch out powerful friends maybe but this would be the loadout for me and that this could be like my hive slash fallen no not fallen it's, it's just it's just hive i think so yeah i like I said, I would love loadouts, the ability to save our loadouts, because I'm kind of getting tired of, like, MacGyvering my own loadouts. Because, as you guys can see, this is my grenade build. I don't know why I have a grenade build, but I have one. And I like it. I like it a lot. Actually, I like it more than I really let, let it lead on. But this is the grenade build that I usually do just in case I want to use grenades for some reason. And, again, I know from, the, from using all of these pieces that this is my grenade build. I know from this this one just by looking at it that's my that's my PVE build that's my PVP build so let me know what you guys think in the comments below I know this is like a weird video but I just wanted to like get this conversation going like I feel like we need we need loadouts we need to be able to save our loadouts because it's it's just it's 2020 dog let me save my loadouts like let me save my loadouts if you want to be super cool let me not only be able to save my loadouts, but the loadouts could actually be saved in my vaults. So that way, if I'm like, I don't have to have three armor sets to make a loadout. I can just have them all in my vault. And then if I'm doing something, well, to be honest, this one would never leave me because I always play a bunch of PvP. But like I said, it would be cool if we could pull from collections as well because we could do it with them. I, dude, that's just another problem by itself. But let me know what you guys think in the comments below. That you could really do a lot with this system. Uh, if that if Bungie really wanted to, they could go like a step further and do loadouts plus sub loadouts. So, like, let's say for PvP, I use Wormhus Crown, but what they could do is like save all of this as the prime loadout, like, because this is all legendaries, and then you could go like, let's say, click to to pvp loadout then once you pick click to pvp loadout you click to this one which it shows you like what's what the stats are and then from there you could be like all right i want to use i want to use stompies and it just picks stompies for you or you could choose like worm husk crown it would be really cool if we just had options to save our loadouts because like i said i i have a bunch of loadouts here it's not even funny so like I like another one that I usually do is this one right here. This one is for when I'm running Garden of Salvation. This is like for the enhanced relay defender. I usually have all of them. I think yeah, this one. So let me let me know what you guys think. I know this is a really weird video, but honestly, I didn't have much to talk about in like just in general. Not only that, but it's just dude like I would really love it if we could just save our loadouts. I'm tired of looking through my armor being like, okay, this is this is one. Okay, this is the one for sure. Like, just just make it easier first. It's more of a like quality of life change than anything else because it's not like the end of the world. I'm still gonna be able to play the game how I play it. It's more of a just uh, like make it easier for me. So let me know what you guys think. If you guys want to follow me on my social media outlets since i in the description below thank you everyone for the support i really do appreciate it uh if you guys are interested in any video video game or anything let me know in the comments below i'll look into it and be safe guys you know what's happening in the world and i will see you guys later